Hey, good morning, guys. This is Stephen Howard and my dog Yucca and Rio. Um, I'm just headed down the mountain. It's a beautiful morning where I'm at. Uh, headed down. I always love this view driving into Red Rock. Right about here, if you remember the Chris McCandless movie, Into the Wild, that was shot right here. Uh, the Mack truck dropped him off from hitchhiking right here. And uh, what a beautiful area. I know Chris uh, hung out in Spring Mountains where I am. And uh, sorry, camera adjustment while I'm driving, which is not safe. Um, I just wanted to say, you know, I, I turned over a new leaf like everybody else does um, on New Year's. You know, I'm optimistic about 2021 and um, I'm really putting my best foot forward. Uh, I've been working on a ranch that rescues horses uh, from death, basically, uh, rescues all kinds of animals. But um, doing that has really brought me kind of back to my roots. Uh, I've been offered a position in San Diego and uh, I'll be running, uh, potentially running a surf school possibly and uh, of my own creation. And uh, I'm really excited. I was a surf instructor for Pura Vida. Uh, Pura Vida down in San Diego, uh, next to where the uh, old ox was. But right by the Crystal Pier, you can find Pura Vida. I believe it's next to the Wiener Schnitzel. Um, anyway, um, board rentals, uh, kayak classes and lessons, and um, teaching people how to surf. And I'm, I'm really excited about this possible endeavor that I'm about to go on. But um, it's in the planning stages. I just wanted to tell you about it. It was kind of a miracle yesterday because uh, I'm painting a barn here in Nevada. And um, while I'm painting this barn, they're talking to me about my, my hopes, wishes, and dreams. And I, I really have, uh, have come to find out that the universe really is answering my prayers. Now, uh, it might not come in the form that you're looking for. I was looking to start a business in Montana, looking to start something uh, on the rivers in Montana. And instead, I've been brought back to the, the ocean, potentially. So uh, I grew up around San Diego. I'm very excited to go back to San Diego. And um, that's where I'm going to put my, my best foot forward right now. Um, I hope everybody is having a wonderful start of their new year. If you're encountering any low vibration stuff, sorry, my dog is completely molesting me. If, um, if, you're, uh, if you're having low vibration or you're having any quarrels or chaos or anything in your life, just realize that that's the last bit of energies from 2021. All you need to do is an energy cleanse, do a lot of saging and get yourself prepared and get your energy clean um, for the next step. And that's exactly what I've been doing is cleansing myself of all of the negative energy that 2021 provided and uh, getting myself prepared for uh, the next stage in my life. Uh, we've just closed a 10-year cycle, and we're opening a new 10-year cycle. So uh, 